we went out on the front porch. We still hadn't said anything to each other other than he said, let's go out on the front porch and talk. We went out on the front porch, and I looked at him, and I said, Alec, and I'm sure I said F or H or something. I said, what, the, you know, what the, is going on? I need to know what's going on because I know about this thing that Lee's called me about, and I need to know if there's something else you've done that involves me that I don't know about that's a problem for me. What is going on? What does he say? He didn't say anything. He broke down crying. Said, I can't talk. Let me, I can't, I can't write this second, Chris. He walked inside and grabbed a handful of paper towels and came back out on the porch and said, you know, I'm sorry. I, I, I've had a drug problem. I'm addicted to opioids. And I don't remember if he said 20 years or exactly how many years, but he said, I've been addicted to opioids for something like 20 years, I think is what he said. And, um, you know, I don't remember exactly how the conversation went. There were parts where it was, I mean, I don't want to say heated like we were screaming and hollering at each other and it never came to blows, but there were parts where it was heated and parts where it was silent and parts where it was probably calmer. He said he had a drug addiction um, and then he admitted he had been stealing money, you know. From who? He, um, from his law firm and from clients. Did he say and from, he had, I mean, he, he didn't specifically spell any certain person out or any certain organization out, but he said, I've been stealing from the firm and from clients. What did he say about that 192 with you? What was the phrase he used? I mean, I'll cut, I have to cuss to say it. He said, Go ahead and say it. He said, I shit you up. I'm sorry, I've shit you up. I'm going to shut a lot of people up. I asked him, how long has this been going on? I couldn't believe that I didn't know it, never saw it, never suspected it, drugs or money. And what did he say? Just said it had been going on for a long time. Did you say anything else in this conversation? Just say he had been good about covering it up, especially the drugs. I mean, I didn't really ask much about the, I didn't know the extent of the client stuff. I knew about me um, and my $192,000. And in the phone call with Lee, he had, he had said that Ellick had been stealing from the firm and from clients. But I didn't know about any specific clients or any specific cases. So I didn't, we didn't talk about that. I didn't ask about that. <laughs> 